Meanwhile, tonight, a Prince George's County family is searching for answers after their 13 year old son was gunned down in their front yard. Jay's Agnew was raking leaves on Tuesday outside his home on Jameson Street when he was shot. He died at the hospital on Friday. News 4 Darcy Spencer spoke with the boy's mother today as police continue their investigation. Jay's Agnew was just 13 years old, an eighth grader. The Prince George's County teen was gunned down in his own yard while raking leaves. His dad had been out there with him doing yard work just minutes before it happened. His dad was gone, he said maybe five minutes, and then he heard the gunshots and he ran out and then he saw um, Jay's on the ground. The shooting happened on Jameson Street in Hillcrest Heights just before 5.30 in the afternoon last Tuesday. He was pronounced dead on Friday. Jay's mom says he was a simple, easygoing boy who was not involved in any trouble. I would call him goofy, fun-loving, um, very, very calm and relaxed and never took anything seriously. No arrests have been made in this case of murder and police have not put out any potential motive. Now family members are concerned about their safety. We are not staying in our residence because I'm scared. I'm scared to go back to my house. And I don't want to have to relive that every single moment. So it's, it's, it's really hard for us. The family has set up a GoFundMe page to help with expenses. They want to bring awareness to gun violence and make sure Jay's murder doesn't end up a cold case. My fear is that he's going to go tomorrow, next week. We're going to stop talking about it. And then we still have to live on with that loss. And whoever did it walked free. And, 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 and that, that shouldn't be. She's asking anyone with information or video that could help with the investigation to come forward. In Hillcrest Heights, Darcy Spencer, News 4. It's hard to hear that mother's hurt. No funeral arrangements have been made yet, but a vigil is planned for Friday. Prince George's County Executive Angela Alsobrooks tweeting today about the boy's death, saying in part, quote, we are absolutely outraged about the senseless shooting death of a 13 year old child in our community. This is unacceptable and should have never occurred in the first place, end quote.